my channel. I hope you guys are having a fantastic week. <laughs> yes. I've had a fantastic week. Mm-hmm. Yes. So, without further ado, let's get busy with today's video, shall we? I'll see you guys in a minute. So today, I am singing Now That I Found You by Terry Clark. Mm-hmm. This is a beautiful song. So, without further ado, let's get busy, shall we? I'll see you guys in a minute. How can I believe that my heart would find someone like you? You see the real me, no in betweens. I had nowhere to hide. You took away the walls around me, made me feel safe to share my truth. I see the heavens open, I heart the once was broken, ain't holding nothing back now that I found you. You hold me like a prayer, you touch me everywhere. A life that just ain't enough to love you true. Now that I found you, now that I found you, do you believe we're meant to be a chemistry that lasts forever? And through the years, we'll see some tears, we'll conquer fears together. They will grow. Looking in your eyes and tell me I no longer have to feel alone. I see the heavens open, a heart that once was broken, ain't holding nothing back. Now that I found you, you hold me like a prayer. You touch me everywhere. A lifetime just ain't enough to love you true. Now that I found you, you see me, the real me. You believe in me. I see the heavens open. A hundred once was broken. Ain't holding nothing back. Now that I found you, you hold me like a prayer. You touch me everywhere. A lifetime just ain't enough to love you true. Now that I found you. Now that I found you. Well, I had a lot of fun seeing Now That I Found You by Terry Clark today. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. So, without further ado, let's get busy with the rest of today's video, shall we? I'll see you guys in a minute. Today, I'm going to talk about my love of school. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yes. Mm-hmm. I love going to school. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yes. I learned a lot of things in school. Mm-hmm. Cooking, sewing. Yeah. When I was in grade nine, I was a lunchtime DJ. They had, like, a little DJ booth on the stage at the cafeteria. And I'd go there on lunch hours and play music. Mm-hmm. Yes. You had to be in grade 9 to do that, so... I did it when I was in grade 9. <laughs> that was so much fun. I was in choir, too. From grade 3 to grade 6, and then again in grade 10. Mm-hmm. Yes. Now, my elementary school that I went to is from grades 4 to 6. But in grades 5 and 6, you got to take part in the spring fling. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Yes. Mm-hmm. I was in choir and main cast for both spring uh, spring flings. Mm-hmm. Yes, grade five and grade six. I love performing, getting on a stage, putting on a show. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yes. And when I was in grade 10, I took a course where we had to prepare food, learn how to cook it and make meals and everything to do with the kitchen. So one time, the high school I was at for grade 10 had a, um event happening in the music room, and we were making the food for it. So my little group, there were six kitchens in this one classroom. My little group, um, we cut up the marble cheese. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that was so much fun, and I felt like I was learning. Yeah. I learned a lot in school. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Yes. We went on many field trips around Prince Edward Island. Mm-hmm. Yes. <laughs> Learned a lot. I went on a few field trips here uh, in Nova Scotia. Mm-hmm. Where I lived from the time I was in grade 11. <laughs> yes. Mm-hmm. I did grade 11, grade 12, and an extra year at the high school in Yarmouth. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yes. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yes. I've had so much experience at school and some great memories. Mm-hmm. Another thing I love about school is you can be with your friends and learn all kinds of cool things. Mm-hmm. My favorite subject was drama. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I also loved getting to and from school, too. Mm-hmm. My first six years, I traveled on a school bus. Mm-hmm. The next six years, grade 7 to grade 12, and actually seven years because I did an extra year to earn my Braille credit. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yes. Braille is a second language for me. <laughs> yes. Mm-hmm. Yes, I have so many great memories. Mm-hmm. So for seven years, I took two different types of accessibility buses. Mm-hmm. Because like I said, I moved in between grade 10 and grade 11 to where I'm living now. And, yeah. <laughs> so, yes. I really enjoyed learning and and meeting new friends and seeing old friends and teachers, moving up through the school system on Prince Edward Island. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I went to five different schools. Yes. One school will be for grade one to three. The next school will be for four to six. Uh, the school after that would be seven to nine. And then school after that would be 10, 11, 12. But I moved from Prince of Brown in between grade 10 and grade 11. Yes. So like I said, I did 11, 12 in my extra year at the high school in town here where I live. <laughs> so that is my love of school. I'll see you guys in a minute with a Q&A question. Today's q and question is, have you ever had anyone ask you if you have a sibling? So today's q and question comes with a story. The answer, mm-hmm. Yes, I've had somebody ask me if I've had any siblings. Mm-hmm. I was on my way home from school one day here in the community where I live. Mm-hmm. And I rode in a van for transportation to and from school uh, here in the community where I live. And it was just me and my my van driver uh, in the vehicle. 
We're heading down the road that goes to my house. Mm-hmm. And about halfway there, she asks me if I had any siblings. At first, I fought up the question, and I didn't know what to say at first. But I thought, I might as well answer the question. So, I told her I had a sister who unfortunately passed away when I was just 13, and she was 16. And I was trying so hard not to cry. Mm hmm. Because it was just such a tough question for me to get through. Mm hmm. But she was very kind and very nice and offered her condolences. Mm hmm. Yes. I was speaking of that recently. Mm hmm. So. That is the answer to today's Q&A question. <laughs> yes. I'll see you guys in a minute with the trivia question. So last week's trivia question was, which song did I do for a lip sync competition when I was in grade six? And that is D. Oops, I did it again. <laughs> This week's trivia question is, what is my favorite room to interior design? Is it A, bedroom, B, kitchen, C, bathroom, or D, living room? And there you have it. That is today's trivia question. So, I'll see you guys in a minute to wrap up this video. Well, I've had a fantastic afternoon with you all. Mm-hmm. Yes. I sang a song. Talked about school. Mm-hmm. Yes. <laughs> mm-hmm. Just all kinds of good stuff. You can like, subscribe, comment, and share. And please, no disrespectful comments. Thank you. <laughs> You can follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter if you like. You guys are awesome, wonderful, and lovely. And don't forget to enjoy life. I love enjoying life. <laughs> yes. Mm hmm So, until next week, have a fantastic week, everybody. <laughs> and I'll see you guys next week with a brand new video. <laughs> mm hmm So. For now, I'm going to say goodbye. Bye. Bye, YouTube.